Good evening, everyone. I'm meteorologist Katie McNeil. You've now clicked on the Weather Now link. Let's jump right into it. Taking a look outside right now, fairly quiet weather this evening. We saw a nice and sunny day today, although a lot warmer. Didn't feel too bad out there, though. Very warm, but dew points throughout the afternoon were a little bit less, so that tropical moisture not as much of a factor today. Unfortunately, though, we're just starting here with that heat over the next several days, Monday through Wednesday. We do have a heat advisory in effect with heat index values and returning humidity well into the low hundreds. So temperatures right now here still in the upper 80s, very warm as we head towards the late evening hours. But again, dew points a little bit less this afternoon, so not as unbearable and oppressive for those feel like temperatures at this hour. But again, as I mentioned, we do have that heat advisory in place starting tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. and lasting until Wednesday evening at 8 p.m. And with that, we're expecting heat index values to reach up to 102 degrees, even maybe slightly higher in some spots during the heat of the day, afternoon hours each of these days. And with that, just some reminders for heat safety with extreme and dangerous heat upcoming in the next few days. Of course, make sure to stay hydrated throughout the next few days here, if you are going to be outside, you know, some people work outdoors, make sure you're staying hydrated and take as many breaks as you can. Be sure your pets as well have plenty of water and a place to uh, hide out in the shade for a little bit, as well as your elderly neighbors uh, who may not have air conditioning or anyone to check on them. This is the type of heat with heat indice values well into the hundreds, as I mentioned, up to 105 in some spots. Uh, it could be very dangerous with even short-term exposure. So just some things to be mindful of as we head into a very warm stretch for the next few days here. In the meantime, though, we're going to be quiet for the rest of this evening. Temperatures still very mild out there overnight in the upper 70s towards midnight here. We'll only be seeing lows around 70 degrees and we'll already be warming up pretty quickly as well as we head towards the morning and afternoon. Highs are expected to be in the low 90s, but again, with those heat index values should be the feel like temperatures could approach around 100 to 102 degrees by the heat of the day. There is also a slight chance for a shower or passing thunderstorm towards the afternoon, especially in northern Rhode Island and southeastern Mass. Anything that does come through, I'm expecting to be more isolated and brief, but that chance is there with a short wave moving through our area during the afternoon hours tomorrow on Monday. With that, your forecast for tonight, backtracking a little bit here. Again, very mild overnight lows around 70 degrees. Clouds are expected to increase as we head towards the start of your Monday morning with the chance for some patchy fog late in the night, especially down towards the coast. With that, we will start off with a little bit more cloud coverage early in the morning. That'll lead way to increasing sunshine by the afternoon with increased humidity as well. Dew points back well into the low 70s, especially by the late morning and early afternoon. And again, those highs very warm out there in the low 90s with those higher dew points returning. We'll see those heat index values around 100 degrees. So very warm out there in the afternoon. Try to limit that outdoor time if you can uh, or stay away from inland areas, especially where it's going to be very warm. Try to stay as cool as possible out there. We are also tracking that slight chance for a shower or thunderstorm during the afternoon hours. Again, anything that does come through is expected to be very localized and more passing, very scattered in nature, so nothing high impact, but that chance is there during the afternoon, especially because we're getting this big warm up in temperatures with all that sunshine throughout the day. So day one tomorrow of the extreme heat. Again, this is expected to continue until Wednesday with that heat advisory in effect over the next three days. So stay safe and stay hydrated out there if you're going to be spending time outdoors. And as always, you can get your full forecast anytime at WPRI.com.